London supported us by our friend and gracious landlord, Jungle. Now, good foodies, gather under my mighty English oak to discover my secret stay. Hi everyone i hope you enjoyed those few clips that was from jungle gyms it's a store in cincinnati ohio there's actually two of them and it's probably one of my favorite stores in the world i don't know i've only been to a few places but um they were at one time were the biggest grocery store i think there's one in wisconsin or somewhere um that's a little bigger but yeah they were the biggest grocery store in old for a while and um, they have a huge international section that I love but yeah so this is a combined haul today so there's some stuff from Jungle Gyms um, some Ibotta deals from Meyer and Kroger and oh and a couple things from Whole Foods so yeah let's just get started I actually look I don't have the receipts with me today so I'm going to try to do it off of memory so I, I might be off of 50 cents to a dollar or so so bear with me so yeah, let's just start. This is the few things um, from Jungle Gyms. This was on sale. So yeah, just even though it's a big store, they still have um, weekly sales, like there's a weekly flyer. So yeah, if you're in that area, um, this was on sale. It was two fifty. Oh, and by the way, so I really was going to try to do more vlogging, I guess, because I do want to do more shop with me's, but I didn't plan well. This was the Saturday before Christmas and it was crazy everybody was in there so yeah I tried my best <laughs> so um yeah 250 for these cheese puffs I've never tried that brand before hopefully it's good um whoops stay still so my husband wanted to get more honey this was $20 from honey that's from Hamilton Ohio which I guess is close enough to Kentucky um usually you try to get honey that's in your area because so that um some of the allergens it helps with allergies. You can look it up. <laughs> Don't believe me. So um, it's raw honey. I like that. So $20 for this 45 ounce jar. My husband said get some for the stockpile because honey really doesn't go bad. Um, I think the rest is international stuff. Okay. So um, S&B. There's actually two S&B things. So golden curry. This is the sauce with the veggies already in it. I add a little bit of meat to it. Usually some shrimp or something. And that's a good little lunch for me. Some wasabi in a tube. Um, this is some nori, um, Japanese seaweed. And this is the big sheets to make um, spam wasabi. Um, some pocky. I'm sorry, I'm just all over the place. That's just me today. <laughs> so pocky, this was like $1.50 each. Yes, you can get pocky pretty much anywhere. Like I've seen them at five below. But my son was with me, so he got chocolate, strawberry, and... Um, chocolate banana and they also had all the different international Kit Kat flavors like green tea and strawberry and stuff so yeah really fun choco crunchies I didn't know where this came from my husband grabbed it and it was actually from the Philippines I've just never tried that one before it's chocolate cookies it's probably really good some Calpico I remember drinking this when I was a kid and um, I was just curious to see if my, my, not my husband my son would like it um, if you're new to my channel, it's just three of us in our little family, my husband, myself, and my almost five-year-old son. But he likes yogurt, so I wanted to see if he liked that. Um, up here, some banana sauce. I asked my husband a while ago if he ever tried it. He probably has, um, but I got one anyways. Um, I got the hot and spicy. Some yum-yum sauce because we were all out. And we've never tried... Um, is this... The, yeah, no. That's the regular one. This is a spicy one. Um, we've never tried the spicy one before, so we wanted to try that. Um, horchata. I used to buy it from Whole Foods, like, I think it was the Rice Dream brand, and yeah, they just don't sell it anymore, so this is a mix, it's like a powder mix, and um, yeah, I really love horchata. Not all Mexican restaurants even sell it, so I'm going to have to make it myself, so it's in a little resealable bag, I like that, 14 ounces it makes seven to nine quarts okay um these juices i know these were like a dollar 19 which is kind of pricey but i guess if it, well these are from hawaii by the way this is hawaiian sun pineapple orange and strawberry guava nectar they're i love them um if they were a little cheaper i'd buy more but i guess if you get it from like a restaurant in hawaii that's about that price anyway so whatever something special for me 
Um, when I'm sick, like if I have a cold, I crave that. I know it's not good for you, but whatever. <laughs> um, and if you're if you're ever in the area to go to Jungle Gyms, check out their beer and wine section. They're huge. Um, and they always tend to have really good deals. So this was actually in a shopping cart. That's just how they do um, like closeout sales is they'll have it in a shopping cart and there was just lots of beer. This is obviously was a summer beer. It's Key Lime Cougar Bait Country Boy, which is brewed in um, Georgetown, Kentucky, not too far from where I live. So, um, oh, and this was only $3.99 and my husband did try one. He said it was really good. It was like really limey, <laughs> like he says, like you're biting into a lime, which I don't know. I guess to some people that would be gross. But yeah, if you're ever in that area, go to that store, check out those deals. So yeah, really fun little store. I really hope to go again. I try to go like once a year because we do go to Cincinnati a few times a year for my son's appointments and stuff. Um, we were actually there for a drive through party. So yeah, that's from Jungle Gyms. Moving on to, um, this is Kroger. So two things that weren't really a deal, but I needed anyways. Oh, well, it's upside down. <laughs> Some potato bread. I do like the private selection bread. It's really good. Um, and this one, it says wide pan bread. And the slices aren't as thick as like the artisan ones. Um, some organic bananas. And wait, no, this is Meyer. No, okay, this is Kroger. Sorry, I got confused there. Z bar. So I actually like these. They're cliff like cliff bars for kids but i like the z bar ones i like the ones meant for kids probably there's a little more sugar in it but these were i know this was 429 there wasn't really any special sale but there it was um i believe there's a coupon a digital coupon for 50 cents off and a hmm either 75 or 50 cents off i bought a two so yeah makes it a little cheaper um if you buy them at costco they're they're kind of pricey, but they are good. They're pricier than like the Quaker Chewy bars, but I think they're much better. Pro probably better ingredients. I don't know. Don't quote me. Let's see. Yeah, a little better. A little less ingredients. So there's that. And last thing from Kroger was Tums. I If you haven't tried these like Chewy Bites, they're actually... I like it better than the Chalky Regular Tums. So these there was a 75 cents off coupon for that. Um, and for all these deals, make sure you check your Ibotta and um, M Perks or Kroger accounts because not everyone gets the same coupons. So there's that. That was all from Kroger. Um, there was other things included. And oh, the reason why I went to like Kroger, Meyer, and Whole Foods was I was also um, last minute Christmas shopping. So I, I didn't include everything here, which is why um, I'm not giving you like the grand totals on anything. But if you are curious on prices, I live in the central Kentucky area and yeah, if you're ever curious about prices or couponing or anything, just let me ask me below. I'm always trying to help. Um, so yeah, that was Kroger. Now this is Meyer. So this was 149. This is Bolt 24. I've had this one before. It's really good. I mean, it's Gatorade. This one says hydration with electrolytes, antioxidant. Cool. So that was 149 and there was a 149 Ibotta. So making it free, my favorite price. So this was almost free, Panera bread at home. I got the hazelnut cream flavor and they had like a dark, I believe. I think that's all my store had. But these are on sale this week. They are two for 10, so $5. But there was an Ibotta deal for $4.50 off, making it 50 cents. And they also have um, 12 ounce grit bags of the ground as well with the same flavors for the same thing, it's $5. And four fifty off, making it fifty cents. So I might go back and get some. Who knows? But yeah, fifty cents for that. I thought that was a good deal. What else? What else? And let me check. Yes, that was it. And this was also for Meyer. So they are on sale. All so the yogurt ones and the Happy Tummies were two for four dollars, so two dollars each. And right now on Ibotta, there is one dollar off for each of these. Um, limit of three. So I got three of the Happy Tummies and it was three of the yogurts as well, but I have um, a small pack from Kroger still to use up. My son isn't a big fan of eating like a lot of fruits and veggies, but he will eat these. So to get some extra nutrients in, I do give him these as well. Yes, I know there's sugar in them, but 
I mean, it's better than a lot of things, right? So the flavors I got were Go Go Squeeze Happy Tummies. Or, oh, and they're organic for these three anyways. I got Apple Mango Pineapple Banana, Apple Strawberry Pomegranate Spinach, and Apple Pear Carrot Raspberry. So I know he'll like all of them. So yeah, a dollar for each pack. If I, I don't know if I told you the price, you know how I am. But <laughs> so a dollar a pack, making them 25 cents each pouch. That's a really, really good deal. Um, but yeah, so that was it from Meyer. And going on to Whole Foods, it was just these one, two, three, four, five things. Oh, and I'm missing two um, bub bubbies. I don't even know, and I'm from Hawaii. Um, Bubby's mochi ice creams out of the cooler. They're now individually wrapped. They used, I don't think they were before. I think there was like a little tongs in the freezer. But yeah, now they're individually wrapped. And on Ibotta, there was a $2 off two. And they are $2 each. So we paid a dollar each for each mochi ice cream. So it was a little treat for my son and I. So yeah, that's not pictured here. But I thought that was a pretty good deal. Um, the rain reason why I went there are for these organic cheddar cheesy smiles. They're the Annie's brand. And these are really good. They're the best cheese puffs. I'm thinking of, I'm kind of lame. I'm that lame mom wife who sticks like things like this or um, undies or socks <laughs> under the tree. I wrap them like, yeah, that's me. So these were on sale. They were two for $6. So $3 each. And if you're an Amazon Prime member and have the app on your phone, um, there's a little QR code when you check out um, and you get 10% off. So it was two seventy dollars each, which was a good deal. Next thing. I don't know what my son's doing. I hear him. Um, this S&W Heirloom Series. This was $1.99 and there is a $1.99 off I bought a deal. So making it free. I mean, you can always use beans. It is um, soup bean and chili season right now. And these were free as well from Ibotta. This is RX Layers. I got the chocolate almond. My husband wasn't a fan of the RX bars. And um, that's why I love couponing is that you get to try it, new products and stuff. So there's a normal RX bar that has very limited um, ingredients. And he did not care for it. I tried it too. I didn't love the texture. My son didn't really either. But this is layers. So let's see. This might be better. We'll let you know. If you wonder how something tastes, um, just Ask me below and I'll, I'll let you know. And a Lara Bar coconut cream pie. Just five ingredients too. I don't think I've ever tried a Lara Bar, honestly. But yeah, so these three things were completely free after I bought it. So that was my little jungle gyms. And I bought mostly I bought a deals from those three stores. If you have any questions, please let me know below. Um, I hope everyone has a wonderful and safe Christmas. I think this is going up after Christmas. So, yeah, I hope everyone had a very Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, and I hope you enjoyed this video. Give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I hope everyone has a wonderful and blessed day. Bye.